Thank you for watching. This is Richard Traveling. We're in Portland, Oregon at the Pioneer Courthouse Square. We're going to take a look at activities and how to get around in the downtown area in Portland, Oregon. If you're a vacationer, business traveler, visitor, or live here for years and haven't quite figured out how to get around, we're going to take a look at ways of getting around. So this is the central point here in Portland, Oregon. This is to be the starting place of where you'd want to go. We're overlooking the courthouse square right now. And we're going to look at activities to the north, south, east, and west, and how to easily get around. If you're on a vacation, you're visiting, you're on a business trip, or if you live in the area, you're going to want to go to downtown Portland, Oregon. The central focus to downtown Portland, Oregon is the Pioneer Courthouse Square. On this video, we're going to go east down to the Willamette River, and then we're going to go north and see the attractions in the city in uh, this area. Then we're going to go to the west and out to Providence Park, and then we're going to go south to the major downtown area. If you're in the downtown area, you're going to want to know about the light rail system. The light rail system, you can catch it from any of these peripheral locations, such as the airport, go into downtown, or if you're in the downtown area, you can actually reach out to these other locations. It makes it for easy traveling without finding a parking spot. Within downtown, there's a streetcar system that loops around the downtown area. So we'll be covering these areas on this video. This is a shot of the old Pioneer Courthouse built in 1895. Population about 650,000 here in the Portland downtown and city. Across the street here we have them all. So we're looking to the east and uh, well, we're going to take a look at ways of getting around downtown here. So we've got one of the excellent light rail systems that you can use to travel and we're going to take a look at that here in a moment. This is the light rail system that runs through this town in all directions. If you can get to the uh, Pioneer Courthouse and that's where we're at here right now, Pioneer Courthouse Square, you can get here, you can go to the uh, west using the uh, light rail you can go to the east using the light rail down to the Tom McCall Park along the Willamette River uh, you can walk a few blocks and catch the streetcar so uh, great uh, travel arrangements here in downtown Portland you're gonna look at the uh, map here you may or may not be able to see this but if you're, you can catch the light rail at these peripheral points and then move in closer to downtown. There's all types of loops here that you can take to uh, move around the city very easily. So we're moving to the east, walking east here along the light rail line. We're going to go down towards the Willamette River and uh, just take a look at the Willamette River and some of the sites along the way here. Just up above is the light rail stop and then we've got Apple computer over here to the right which is uh, full of all kinds of people in there checking out their equipment. So we're going to walk across the street here and uh, let's take a look. So right now we're on 5th and Yamhill and moving to the east here we have the Apple store here loaded for, with people trying to check out their equipment. And across the street here you can catch the light rail and uh, take you across town here. So 
we're on 4th and Yam Hill. We've got a mall here. We're about a block off of the uh, Pioneer Port Courthouse Square. And this is a mall. You want to do shopping. Again, if you get downtown to the Courthouse Square, you can move around from that location, north, south, east, and west. So here's the uh, beginnings of this mall. We're not going to go in it, but uh, real nice mall. Lots of traffic and stores and shops, restaurants. We've got the Chipotle Mexican Grill here. As we work our way down, we're headed down towards the Tomacall Park on the riverfront. Subway. Looks like we got the Portland Mongolian Grill and Hot Pot. Chinese food, Mongolian food. And then we've got a pizza restaurant here. We're down to about 2nd and Yam Hill. Working our way towards the Pioneer, toward the uh, Tom McCall Park here. We're on the Willamette River now. We worked our way east from the Pioneer Courthouse Square. We're down here at Tom McCall Park. We're actually in the process of setting up a big event coming up, the Cinco de Mayo Festival here in uh, Portland, Oregon. So they're getting the event uh, tables, tents and all set up here. So we're looking back uh, down into downtown. We're gonna head back to the west, back to the P Pioneer Courthouse Square and uh, take a look on the north side of Pioneer Courthouse Square. Okay, we're back at the Pioneer Courthouse Square and we're on Morrison Street, Broadway and Morrison. We're going to work our way up to the west this time, up to about the 10th Street. And we'll look at some of the shops and restaurants along 10th Street. Okay, we worked our way up here just a few blocks to Morrison and 10th Street. And we're looking to the north on 10th Street. Got some shops in here, Starbucks, and various other shops. We're gonna walk on down the street here. Well, we're at the... 
on 10th Street here we have the famous Jake's Grill one of the top restaurants in the area then across the street have something real interesting uh, we well we have Target here in front of us and then over here to the left is the Portland street vending most cities won't allow this but uh, you can get all kinds of food with these street vendors Inter interesting concept it gives the entrepreneur a chance to be in business Korean barbecue Thai food Mexican food El Rodeo lunch this whole block here is made up of street vending what kind of food is this? Chicken. Chicken. What do you call that? Chicken shawarma. You want to try a sample? Not right now, but it sure looks good. We'll have to try it later. Thanks a lot. Thank you too. That was the Portland streetcar. Takes a loop around the downtown area. Excellent way to get around downtown Portland. Okay, we're at 10th and Burnside, Powell Books, world's largest single owner distributor of books here in downtown Portland. We're in Pal Books here right now, and lots of activity here. It's one of the largest bookstores in the world. Here's some artwork at Burnside and 10th, and then of course across the street here is the Pal Books. So we're going to head back towards Pioneer Courthouse Square, and then we're going to head to the west and take a look at some of the features. Okay, we're going to catch the tram and we're going to head up to the north here on the light rail. If you want to rent a bike, they have bike rentals all over the place and tour the city on a bike. Okay, we took the light rail up to the west side here and this is Providence Park, home of the Portland Timber Soccer championship soccer team. Here's a look at the light rail and streetcar map. So we're up here by Providence Park right now. Pioneer Courthouse Square is back here so uh, you can start park out here in Hillsborough, take this light rail into town. You can start in Wilsonville and go into town. Uh, same way come from the airport out here and uh, Gresham area so you can pick up these peripheral areas Clackamas town center and 
make your way into downtown. So there's various loops around here. You can park in one place downtown perhaps, and you can use the light rail and the streetcar to loop around, and it makes it very easy to get around without having to pay and try to find parking spots. Okay, we're gonna take the Max Light Rail back into the Courthouse Square area. We're really not that far away, but it's just an easy way to get around. Okay, we're back to the Pioneer Courthouse Square. So, so far we have been down to the north we just finished going to the west. Earlier we went to the east. And we're going to take a look here on the south. Ruth's Chris Steakhouse. One of the popular steakhouses here in the area. Over here we have the Fox Tower. And then across the street we have the Columbia Sportswear Company manufactures some of the best sportswear that you can find. It's not their manufacturing facility, but it's a sales outlet in the downtown area. Then coming up here, just right here to our left, is the Hilton Hotel. The Oregon Symphony meets in the con Snitzer Concert Hall. And right across the street, we have the Performing Arts. So we're right in the major downtown area, getting into more businesses on the south side here. We're going to head back to the Courthouse Square area where we started.